Howdy y'all and welcome to Lex Lives. I think it's time we play a little Lebronia RPG. Alright, now I gotta remember what button does what. <laughs> okay, so we are saved right before a boss here. So I want to make sure uh, that I am ready to go. Uh, oh yeah, see look at that. I am not ready to go. Let's go ahead and we'll use up our... Well, not use up, but... Uh, let's see. Deals water damage and weakens the enemy's magic defense. Nice. Let's get our health back full here. And... Uh, we ch ch I keep pushing the triangle button on my controller here. And I don't know why, because the only two buttons it needs are the circle and the X. Uh, Alright. Why does it think that the why does it think that the seal bucker buckler bucker the seal buckler is better than the cross shield they're identical except that the cross shield regenerates AP during the fight yes save my game I don't know how bad this thing's going to be I've never fought a boss so oh uh a fairy I've heard that they have a habit of switching sides. I'd better just concentrate on staying alive for a moment and hope for the best. Ooh. Oh, are you kidding me? I could have killed one of those guys. Don't kill me, Mr. Tentacles. Okay, well, they really didn't do that much damage. I've, I've seen much worse. Might have to use a heal here in a second. Fairy just keeps casting Intensify. Way to dodge. Okay, so healing myself did me absolutely no good. Because they did so much damage that round that I actually below where I was at. Ooh. Nice. I guess I'm supposed to be attacking the floaters? I guess the fairy was just there to give me a slight bonus, but this group of dudes shouldn't really be that terrible to take out. They would have been if I hadn't waited for the fairy to cast that iron body buff on me. That's going to make this fight a little easier. By a little easier, I mean a lot easier. Aw. Not if I miss. <laughs> There's a lot of these guys. There's too many guys. we got to take some out here. There we go. Now, if we take out uh, five more, then uh, then we should be good. That'll make the fight a lot easier. Oh man, there went my iron body. Alright, I'm going to use one of these lavender... Or lavender glass violets. Get rid of this blind. Ah, oh, well that was a waste. Man, I was really hoping to get that off there so I can just kill these guys. They're way weaker now, though. They were doing a lot of damage before. That fairy was hanging around, buffing them. <laughs> blind sucks! I hate being blind. I can't wait to get away from these 
stingrays. No, they're not stingrays. Jellyfish. There we go. That'll help some more. This isn't is what I was expecting from my first boss fight. Uh, I really thought it was going to be really crazily difficult. Uh, but this isn't bad at all. So far. I mean, it's not over. Maybe they'll combine into a giant jellyfish, or maybe a giant jellyfish will come out. Who knows? I've seen it before. Aww. Oh, that was enough to take this guy down. Alright. This round here, I've definitely got to heal again. I wonder if there was an item that would stop me from being blinded every five seconds. That'd be awesome. Yeah, I, uh... <laughs> I'll tell you a funny story. Well, it's not really that funny, but... Um, I noticed that uh, after I uploaded my first video of this that it's cropped funny. Uh, and, uh, like, like this part, of course, is cropped because the game is not 1080p. It's, I mean, it's not designed to be 1080p. It's designed to look like this. But it also chopped the intro and outro on the video down and put black bars on the sides. And I'm like, what is going on? And, uh, so... I thought maybe uh, I thought maybe I had done it during recording last time, and uh, or not during recording, during rendering. And so I'm looking at my rendering settings, and uh, I'm making sure everything says it's going to record in 1080p and all that. And uh, I tweak some settings to thinking maybe that's what caused it. And so I render the video, and it looks fine. Uh, it's exactly what I want. Beginning is, you know, full screen, middle is this, end is full screen. And, uh, but the file sizes I get are huge. And so, uh, you know, watching some, some other people who do videos and, and reading, uh, people use a program called Handbrake, and uh, it re-encodes your video into a smaller size um, without losing a lot of, a lot of quality. And so... Uh, I ran it through Handbrake, and so I render it, it looks fine, I run it through Handbrake. Handbrake is cropping my videos just for this series, for some reason. So, I probably, probably ran my video through Handbrake three times before I figured out which sitting was, was doing it. Apparently, apparently it was automatically cropping based on the majority of the video. I I don't understand why it decided to crop the beginning and end. It doesn't do it on any of my other videos. Just this one. So uh, I had to put it on custom crop and turn the crop off. Which I thought was kind of funny. Oh, come on. It's being blind is boring me. Hurry up. Boring. There we go. Yeah, I'm not blind now. Take him out. Good. He missed. Oh, he evaded. Well, at least he just attacked and didn't try to blind me again. Just me and you there, big boy. Nice. And I hit level 7. Whoa. Don't mind me. I want to go back here. Save my game. Not that I think this statue is about to attack me, you understand, but this statue might attack me. Found a Q. Croton, the god of water. Learned Wave. I never even used my new ability. 
What's this thing behind him? Oh, let me get this chest first. The jail key. What's this? Uh, Something for later, apparently. It looks like a doorway, but... I can walk behind it. Alright, what's wave? Deals water damage to all enemies. Oh, nice. It's like the upgrade to water, which I've never cast. Uh... So it's been a couple days since I played. I don't know if I can remember how to get out of here. I'm pretty sure this is not it. I gotta go down one more here. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure this is it, but then I saw that it just curls around. Uh, oh yeah, there's a stairway, right? Somewhere. Down... Here? No. Uh, down here? No. Down here. Oh, look, I pretty much almost went right to it. Awesome. Hey, dude, I got the jail key. <gasps> you have the key? Well done. Yeah, just go ahead. I think I'll be just hanging around here for a while. It's kind of cozy. Use the jail key. Oh. That's, um... Interesting. Hey, you, stop right there. You way over there, are you talking to me? Because... I'm not sure... I'm not sure why you... think you can stop me. Are you coming for me? Am I going to have to fight this guard? I am! Ooh, look at him. Let's hit him with wave. Or water, I mean. Wow, that did 193 damage. Okay, well I guess my normal attack did a lot of damage too. You're not very strong, dude, other than I'm stunned. Uh, sorry, I just killed your guy. I didn't mean to kill your guard, but... You know, you people jumped me. You could have just said I wasn't welcome. I would turn around and gone home. Let's go. Let's go. That's right. Face my spell. In fact, you know what? Get it again. Yeah. Yeah. I'm talking about. Even your town is like a maze. Or maybe this is just the jail part is like a maze. Yeah, okay, that doesn't go anywhere. Let's go guard. Ooh, two guards. You know what that means. Wave. Ooh, wave is cool and really powerful. This is gonna kill both these guys. Oh, it didn't. What do you got, like five hit points left? You ever play one of these games where they show you the uh, hit points and you'll like do this amazing attack <clears throat> and it'll leave them with one hit point? I hate that stuff. You gonna go two guard? You got out from the labyrinth? Quite a feat. So perhaps we misjudged you. A more or a mere commoner would never have made it would never made it out there alive. A mere commoner would have never made it out there alive. I think you're missing a word. As for compensation, you may go free now, but don't stay long. We generally don't like outsiders. Also, I would watch my step at this point if I were you. There are some concerning cracks on this ground. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, we can't restrain him with our small force. Yeah, I kind of... I kind of killed your guards... You don't suppose these cracks lead to, like, special places, do ya? I'm honestly kind of tempted to 
fall through on purpose. These black things look like stairways. Except I can't interact with them, so... Hmm. What's this? Found a cue, Mage's Monument. Ares learns Will Strike. That's weird that I found a cue I couldn't use in every cue since then I've been able to use. Um, skill. Attacked enemy may lose its concentration for a while. Effective against spellcasters. Interesting. Alright. Oops, I stepped on a crack. Oh, wait. None of these... Oh, there we go. Oh, it put me back in the labyrinth. Oh, man. I was hoping it was, like, something special. Hmm. I don't think I've ever been in this part of the labyrinth, actually. It didn't go anywhere, though. It didn't even lead me to a boss fight. Oh, it did lead me someplace different, though. It's Q, but I can't use it. Okay. I saw this earlier, and I was wondering how to get over here. Um... <laughs> I like the little... Rolling the rock. Alright, I'm gonna go save my game, and then we can head into Janice and see what's going on in here. See how much this weapon that guy told me to go buy is. Weird. Look, you just walk right in. Where are the guards now? Welcome to Janus, Traveler. I hope you enjoy spending time with us. We are wealthy and well-mannered people. No, you've already annoyed me, and I've killed several of your guards. I love rain, she says. Uh, What's this? I haven't seen one of these before. Bellet's house. Bellet, you got anything I can steal? Oh, look at that. Bellet, you got some books. Read the book. Yes. Downfall. Our time in Imperia was glorious indeed, but as it seems to be with most good things in life, it too had to come to an, its end. We were attacked by monsters. Wielding powerful magic and brute force, these unnatural creatures clashed with our army. We fought well and were close to a victory. Then happened the event we had been fearing months beforehand. We had no choice but to look in horror as it all became a reality, as our walls were crumbling. The labyrinths had reached the city, the ground was shaking under our feet, as the bases of earth itself was moved by the divine... What? Uh, was moved by the divine force of the gods. I'm pretty sure that's a <laughs> another grammatical thing. Unbelievable formations were born under our very eyes, and every element was affected. In deep disbelief, we witnessed things like the metamorphosis of clouds and waterways. Their forms changed to these maze-like structures. So odd were we that our... Lesser enemy, the monsters, caught us by surprise. The city was lost. Woo. And the people of Janice were, of course, originally Empyrean citizens. After the fell of the capital, the fell of the capital, many things changed except the hierarchy between the people. Mages are still the highest authorities of the people, as they were before the exile. Mages give orders to city guard, a bunch of strongest individuals upholding the law. The employees in the working class follow respectively. The noble practice of slave trade has been almost non-existent after Imperia was lost. Oh, wow. I really am not a fan of these people. Bellet, what do you want, Cretan? Really? I've got no time for lowlife such as yourself. Now get lost. Thanks, lady. Uh, I think that was a lady. We'll pretend it was a lady. So, that's a symbol for rude woman. It's not. I'm just being silly. Hmm, that looked odd. I had to check it. Uh, let's see. Got some 
Armor's in here, maybe. Nothing I can steal, though, it looks like. What you doing, kid? Tom, you know, I already have a terrifying amount of money. 300,000 gold, to be exact. That's why I need to collect it some more. Great fish robe. Reduces the damage from water-based attacks. No. Cross shield. A light shield with a cross regenerates aura. Yep, I'm using one of those. Delicate plates. A breastplate made of very light metal. Now, see, that's better than what I'm wearing. Beggar's crown. An iron crown for those lacking fortune. No, that's not any better than what I'm wearing. Jaded cloak. Or that just says jade cloak. In the past, used by the novice mages. Uh, white mask. Whoa. It's also 3,000 golds. Protects the face surprisingly well. And magic glove. This silk glove offers no physical project protection. It's used by the archer, apparently. Um, I'm going to wait until I see weapons, because weapons are usually more important than... I like a good offense, you know what I'm saying? Nobleman, Janice doesn't really have an army. We just have a couple of strong guys upholding the law. Bellet is pretty much giving the rules for everyone in here. Oh, well, I talked to Bellet. She was mean to me. A beautiful sculpture made out of crystal. Oh. Thanks for being totally useless. Glad I walked over there. Little girl, I wish I could walk on lily pads. You know, I tried to walk on the lily pads. They wouldn't let me. This looks like boots. Shoemaker. Uh, these shoes have wings. Are you interested about the light step boots? It's the last pair. Bring me more velvet leather, leather and I can sell them to you. Where can I find this leather? The orcs should have some. They've been rampaging inland lately. Interesting. Welcome. If you have money, I'm more than glad to serve you. Winged boots. Wow. I cannot afford what they're selling in this place. <laughs> The really good stuff is really expensive. Like, way beyond what I have money for. Okay, that's the inn again. What a curious monument. I wonder if that blue crystal is magical. And what, <laughs> what an absolutely exciting formation surrounds it. Are those labyrinths conscious or something? Hey, that's just like the one that's down in the... Down in the uh, labyrinth, except uh, it wasn't lit up. Here's a house that doesn't have any symbol on it. And the door's locked. Daddy, Daddy, there's a poor person outside. Don't open unless you want to witness manslaughter. Hmm, I doubt you could take me. What about this place? Oh, I could go in here. Poor house. Poor man. I am the poorest person in Janice. The only reason why I'm allowed is... The fact that I saved the life of a noble. I only have 20 golds left. What to do after I've used them? Dude, there's a chest over here. I got your 20 golds! I totally got your 20 golds. I just stole the poorest man's gold. I am such a hero. Rude guy, you look dirty. What have you been doing? Oh, you must be a pig farmer. Nice. Turn. The monument of the water crystal lies beyond this point. Unfortunately, the area is off limits now. You would need permission from Bellet, the mage, to enter. Gotcha, rude woman. Those cracks on the ground are worrying me. What in the world is going on? One day, I heard a scream behind this fence. When I turned to look, there was nothing but a hole in the ground. Yeah, I already fell through there. I'm not falling for that again. Uh, what's in here? Noble house. Hey, kitty. Meow. Meow. Another rainy day. How tasteless. Well, i rather spend my days in my luxurious home anyways. Rich woman, I heard that our unofficial ruler, Bella, is searching for some magical object. Apparently, the resting place of that item is in Water Shrine, northwest from here. Hmm. 
So Bellet needs something from the water shrine. Got it. I saw the water shrine on my way in here. Didn't I? Uh, yeah, I. Uh, it wouldn't let me in. Or would it let me in? I don't remember. Oh, here we go. This is what I'm looking for. We have the fanciest weapons in all Lebronia. They make great decorations. What? Uh, okay, so there's 8 damage higher. That's 3 damage higher. Great for critical, critical hits. Ooh. Huh. I kind of want this rapier. <sighs> Stop pushing that button. I don't know why you think that button is going to do anything. It never works. I'm selling this seal buckler. I am tired of my game switching on me automatically. Sell. Weapons. Armors. Okay, I still got 600 gold. I can go buy that uh, chest plate. You know, the poor guy had a chest that I could grab money out of. Why don't know you rich people? Hmm? Answer me. They're not going to answer me. I wonder where, how much it costs to stay in the inn. Oh, but that's ridiculous. Oh. That's actually not bad. But no, I'm... It's not because I'm broke. It's because I don't need to stay at your stupid inn right now. The Worlds of Labyrinths, Part 1. How are the labyrinths in our world forming? For starters, the actual cause of labyrinths is a magical object called the Pendant of Labronia. I wish to examine the workings of this item more closely. So what is this pendant, and how does it work? According to the descriptions written by the mages of old, the pendant itself is formed like a spiral... We have concluded that this formation follows a principle called fractal reproduction, which itself allows the nature which itself allows the nature grow seemingly without limits. Which itself allows the nature grow seemingly without I don't know what that's supposed to say. We believe that the spiral shape of the pendant itself does not only resemble the forms found from the surrounding nature, all we have to do is gaze into the windy vortexes or count the rippling edges of cloud formations to find self-similarities. Self-similarities. But it's actually the exact same thing observed from a different scale. Arguments about the importance of its observers themselves are ongoing. Weird. Alright. Oh, here's somebody. Derek, have you heard about advanced techniques against more powerful enemies? No. Here's a good kip. Kip? Wow. Good tip. If you fight against an enemy who uses a lot of elemental attacks, just equip an armor that reduces the elemental's damage. You might find gear like that from some of the stores here. Oh, you know what? If I'm going to go in the water temple, I should take the water protection. Um, and who might you be? Actually, don't tell me. I don't even want to know. Wow. You know, I just finished playing Kingdoms of Amalur uh, Reckoning. And everybody on there was rude like that. Every single quest giver, pretty much, was just rude. It's just like this town, the entire game. I know, dude, you're rich. Uh, I would like to buy the great fish robe and the delicate plate. Thank you. Yep, can't push the right buttons. Uh, alright, I would, whoops, I would like to replace this with this, and blah blah blah, I know you've got money, alright, that gets us a new weapon and new armor, and they want us to go to the water shrine, apparently, and I need to kill ogres. So with that, uh, I think we'll call it a day, and we'll pick up with our quest to kill uh, orcs, not ogres, 
and maybe the water shrine next time. So click like if you like, subscribe, be sure and catch the next one, and I will talk to you later.